I'm Dave Mullard, I'm Business Development Manager at Straight Point, and today I'm going to share a technical tip um, on another of our products. So today I'm going to talk about the pairing process um, between a load cell and its handheld. Now if you're familiar with our equipment already you'll know that on the old system um, every load cell was paired with one handheld. So if you had 10 load cells um, then you would have 10 handhelds. It was a fixed one-to-one -one system. Now, uh, thanks to recent upgrades, uh, we're, we're able to put you, the user, um, in charge of that pairing process. And today's video is going to show you how. So first of all, um, if you take a handheld and a load cell, and in the load cell, we need to have one battery installed. Now, on the handheld, we're gonna enter into the pairing mode so to enter the pairing mode, we're going to press the first and second buttons at the same time. And it says pairing mode. So would you like to clear the current paired load cells? Press the power button to say yes. And that's what we want to do. So yes. And then it goes into a screen where it's waiting for a pairing from a load cell. Now to execute that pairing, we just need to put in the second battery on top of where the first battery was. So just click that into place there. And you'll see then that on the handheld, it now shows in position one, the serial number of the load cell that we've connected to. Now to exit out of that, we press the first two buttons again. And then after a few seconds, it will get a connection. We can just tear that down to zero, and then you're ready to use your load cell. So it shows the serial number here, and you've got a connection between that load cell and that handheld. So why is that important? Well, as I said, previously, if you had 10 load cells, uh, then you'd have needed to have 10 handhelds. Whereas now it's possible that one handheld could connect to your radio link, but it could also connect to uh, your wireless load shackles, if you've got this type of load cell, or it could connect to your wireless compression load cells. So it gives you, the user, a lot more flexibility and uh, it might mean that you don't need quite as many of these little bad boys. Okay, well, hopefully that's been helpful. Thanks for watching and uh, see you next time.